Hey, in less than an hour, President Trump is going to be landing in Greenville for a campaign rally. At least that's the plan. CBS 17's Colleen Quigley live right now at the Pitt Greenville Airport. You've been out there early, Colleen, and no doubt, so have a lot of supporters. Yeah, Bill, I mean, this tarmac behind me is full of President Trump supporters. Some tell me this is their first time attending a campaign rally, but they wanted to come out to hear from the president themselves. I'm going to step out of the way so you can get a better view of this crowd here today. Now, President Trump has visited North Carolina several times during this campaign, and supporters here today tell me that that just signifies how important this state is in the upcoming election, which is now, believe it or not, 19 days away. Uh, they told me this state is a battleground one day field of president. President must win. Now, if you're looking in the crowd today, most people we spoke to are wearing masks. Some are not, but everyone we spoke to said they felt pretty comfortable out here today despite the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Now, this week, a group of North Carolina physicians submitted a letter to President Trump's campaign demanding they actually cancel this campaign rally, citing the endangerment of public health and saying the president continues to downplay the disease. Now, the president, again, as you said, Bill, expected to be here at 1 o'clock. We will, of course, be here covering that for you on our news app and on social media. We'll check back in with you in about 30 minutes. For now, reporting live in Greenville, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News. All right, Colleen, appreciate it.